And just a reminder, you can wear red to raise awareness this Friday. Get your appetite ready because tomorrow is National Homemade Soup Day. Master Chef Juan Mandrogon, who is an international chef from Mexico City and also a friend of mine, came to pay us a visit. Here we have uh, this green pozole, which is, uh, is no meat, is made with mushrooms, which is very healthy because mm -hmm. it, you will see all the ingredients that we have over here. Mm -hmm. First of all, to make this pozole is really good. I recommend you make it home. We'll start with the tomatillos. So you should put the tomatillos in the blender machine. Better heal, which is good for you too. Mm -hmm. Parsley. So parsley is half a bunch of each one, the perejil, cilantro. Mm -hmm. And then epazote. Epazote is a, it's a Mexican herb. This is a vegetarian pozole. Exactly. And then you can also make it vegan by putting a vegetable broth instead of chicken broth. And then that's all what you have to do. It's easy, it's cheap, and, and it's very delicious. <laughs> and on the, on the, on the pat. Okay. Right. There you go. How long do you boil it for? Around 20 minutes. What was the what was the reason why you decided to start cooking healthy dishes? I know you have a story. Yes, uh, my sister mm -hmm. has cancer a long time ago, and she survived because we made everything organic for her. Mm -hmm. I think it was the it was God, the medicine, but also the food, because for she was in level four, and then okay. she went to level three level two and right now she's eight years free of the cancer and wow. I think it's the food is we are what we eat mm -hmm. uh, so this is so easy it's cheap why would not to eat healthy why not take care exactly. of yourself this is very delicious it and looks especially with beautiful the mushrooms. I don't even want to touch it because it looks so beautiful <laughs> okay I'm gonna go ahead and try it the mushroom wow this is uh, really everything. good And it was very good indeed. It was, and the chef did add the hominy in the soup as well. You can go to crossroadstoday.com for the recipe 